Good afternoon and happy Saturday, you guys. I have not been in the pool in a very long time because it's been raining and raining and raining and raining. And it's probably going to rain today. Yeah, check that out. Oh, it looks kind of awesome, actually. But I think I'm gonna get in the pool anyway. I haven't heard any lightning or thunder yet, so I think I'm still good. So yeah, yay! Holy crap balls, that pool feels amazing. Um, I feel bad though because I couldn't find the GoPro, so I would have taken you guys in with me, but I need the GoPro for that, and I don't know where Tim put it, so I am very sorry. I like how the second I get out of the pool, like literally the second I get out of the pool, blue skies, super crazy sunny bright. <laughs> oh, I don't know if we showed you guys the wind chimes we got in the PO box, but look how, look, check out these awesome, like tons of shells, very beachy, and we got a little gnome guy next to the baseball bat that actually came with the house and it was propped up by the window which was kind of scary but free bat so yay <laughs> all right i mowed the lawn i am super sweaty it is really hot out here and now i wish it would rain um man remember that phil collins song ah, how i wish it would rain wait that's not that's not phil collins um, I'm gonna jump in the pool now, all right. So now that I'm done in the pool, I'm doing some chores, getting some laundry done, and also I'm going to cook some dinner. And tonight I'm gonna make something that we got in the P.O. box. It is one of the so juicy cook in the bag things, but this time it's Tuscan sausage. So this one called for six pork sausages. The package that I bought only had five, so hopefully it'll still work. Uh, it also called for some a can of butter beans and it actually called for half of this amount i'm just gonna use it all i think it'll be okay and then a an entire red onion sliced the red onions at the store looked pretty terrible so i just got a white onion and two carrots also sliced so i'm not really following this recipe exactly but i think it'll still be pretty good and now it does say if you want crispier sausages to go ahead and brown them in a skillet first so i think i am going to do that these are the sausages that i got you can also get like a hot sausage if you want but this was just a mild italian from Publix. so all i have these in the skillet getting ready to brown i've also drained and rinsed the can of butter beans that i have so those are all ready to go in the bag so i went ahead and i preheated my oven to 360, which I probably should have done it a lot sooner, but I totally forgot. So now I'm gonna mix up the seasoning that comes in the bag with some water. I'm gonna put my sausages in the bag and also my veggies and we'll be good to go. Got my sausages in the bag. I'm gonna put my onions in there. Okay, so that's a lot of onion. It's an entire onion. Carrots, all right, and that was um, about three large carrots sliced. Okay, and I've also added my beans. It's a lot of beans. I have mixed up my seasoning, which kind of smells a little bit like spaghetti sauce, and uh, some water. And then I'm gonna go ahead and pour it in here now. Okay, so there you have it. It's not fully coated. I think that's probably because I have too many beans in there. But yeah, it smells delicious. So I'm gonna go ahead and tie the end with the little thing that they give you, put it in the oven for 45 minutes on the very bottom rack. And hopefully when it comes out, it'll be even more delicious than it looks right now. So here we have it. It's going in the oven now. There it goes. See you in 45 minutes. The best thing about these bag meals is that the dishes are pretty minimal and I like that. I also made mashed potatoes earlier and I forgot to film it for you guys, I'm sorry, but there they are. Okay, just pulled it out of the oven and it uh, looks pretty delicious. I'm gonna wait a couple of minutes so it cools down and then guess what? Oh no, Armani hates it. You kind of look like you were doing insanity. He goes, <laughs> Oh no. Our Moo Moo didn't like it very much, but his tail's wagging, so I'm conflicted. Nope, he is. Oh no. Are you hungry? Feed me Seymour! You hungry? Man, look at how delicious that looks. Holy macaroni. Oh, and by the way, we got a ton of mail to go through. We're gonna put out another mail vlog on Monday. Next Monday, even. It's a beautiful evening, just not over there. Do do do. But it's really nice over here and over here. So we are on our way down to City Walk to watch Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. What did you guys think of it? Don't tell me any spoilers, even though I've already seen it by the time you guys see this. But some other people in the comments may not have seen it yet. No spoilers. Nice. Doesn't fail. Some sweet, sweet Florida traffic. All 
right, here's the construction update for the... Hotel expansion. Yeah. And there's a tree. And here's a construction update for the pedestrian walkway. So exciting. It's like roundy. I like that it's roundy. All right. There it is. Insider tip. If you're coming to Universal, try to avoid the 6 o'clock hour because it goes down in price for parking. And look at this. It's just craziness. We missed our movie time, so we're going to try to get a different one. See, because we already bought them. We missed everything. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if we can exchange it for another time or even just return it. I don't know. Sorry about the wind, though, because of that. Yeah, looking pretty crazy. Seems like a strange car to drive to Universal. Jurassic Park 503. It's kind of fun. Am I the only one who truly 100% believes that the security guards should get wands instead of just like sticks to search bags? That would be a good idea, good selling point. All right, we got our movies changed to the next one, which isn't until an hour from now, but it's an IMAX. Well, that'll be good. Look, guys, cowfish. Yay, cowfish. Oh, cowfish, you don't know how long I've been waiting. Well, I haven't been waiting that long, but I'm excited to eat it in you. This cow with the fake fin is my hero. You guys paying $10 for hot dogs? Hey? Whoa. I like how this fish has a saddle and spurs. Doesn't really make much sense, but I like it. It's been a long time since I've been in this movie theater. It is ridiculous looking in here. It's like the giant movie theater with an escalator in it. Did Jen's gonna get a one? special Guardians of the Galaxy drink. Jen's getting Drax the Destroyer, and it's like all green and everything. He, he's the bad guy, look, there right? he is, I think so. Oops, I'm not even showing it. Yeah. Just to look and see what was in it. Look, it does look like a Mountain Dew. Look at my fancy cup I got. It looks like Mountain Dew. <laughs> So, so much surround sound happening. Oh, it was a fun movie. Yay! I enjoyed it a lot. It was really good. You guys should go go see it for sure. Well, well and we didn't even because we were running so late. We didn't even get. Can we show you? What? Can you be in the video? Oh. Hey, okay, I'm wait. here. That's Ryan. <laughs> Ryan's here. We got uh, like commemorative cups too. It's pretty yeah. awesome. And I spilled Jen's drink all over the girl in front of us. Oh my god. It was like I'm a super so sad <laughs> like scene and I was like trying to hold her hand and I was like fumbling yeah, around and then I was like <laughs> totally crying and then he spills tequila all down my leg. I know it was like it's like all over my butt too. <laughs> it's, we're the worst. I'm well not worst. I'm the worst at just being not clumsy in general and walking through people. Serious question though. Who whistles for he's a jelly good fellow walking into the bathroom? Oh my god. <laughs> Just enough time to watch all the parks close, and then this is what happens. Definitely does not look like it's going to be fun to uh, drive home in. Oh, it's bright in here. You can always tell when a movie is very enjoyable because you're talking about it for the rest of the night or like you're thinking about different things. With these Marvel movies, I'm super impressed with the way that they've kept this like storyline going throughout all the different movies and like the after credit things that they put in and stuff like that. Pretty awesome. Nice work, Marvel. But we're finally back home, and I was totally gonna talk with you guys about like how great the movie was and all kinds of different stuff about the movie. I don't want to give any spoilers, but um, I decided not to do that because it's way late and I gotta get up early in the morning. Yay! So I'm gonna go to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price. Do you hear something over there, Bandit? What'd you find? Is it a ghost? Aliens. What is it, Bandit? Tell us in English. Talk to us. It was a raccoon. I am Groot. I am Groot. <laughs>